what is up guys welcome back to the channel a little bit of a different video i know i know you're expecting an opening um whether it be a pack or a box something along those lines well we're doing a little bit of different i if you watched my previous video not uh what was it thursday thursday's video it was supposed to be wednesday's video but i uploaded on thursday because i didn't have an opportunity to upload on wednesday um hold the buckle but if you watched the video before that, that was an actual pack opening of like 26 user packs that were previous that were sent to me. Um, they were all supposed to be hollow or better. As you see, that wasn't hollow or better. If you haven't watched that video, go back, watch it. I'll put a link in here somewhere if I can figure out how to put a link. Um, but today's video is actually the follow up to that previous video where we did that. Um, we have a ton of bulk to go through. Let me go grab that bulk real quick and I'll be right back and we'll flip maybe the camera around. I lied. I don't flip the camera around. But it did fall. Bear with me. It's late. But as you can tell, we do have a ton of bulk right here. Um, I don't have my normal setup going on right now, so I don't have anything to watch from the top. This will be a little bit of a different video. In a sense. So let's see. We have some packaging. Now, all of this bulk is courtesy of a buddy of mine. Um, let's see. So right off the bat, Ultra Ball has a ton of coins. Let's see. Anything particularly outstanding in here. We've got some of the celebrations. You might even say this is a, a misprint or a miss mold. Uh, oh, my nose are kind of long. I need to cut those. Let me hide those. Um, some Urshifu. Foods. Hey there. This is actually one of my favorite coins. Um, looks like it has the same um, problem going on. Just a little quality control hey there but the genesec purple is probably my favorite coin currently there's another one from the looks of it So now we actually have the pair. I'll have to do some readjusting. There's that Genesec that I really like. But yeah, we'll have to add this in here. Um, along with our other ones. That's pretty cool. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and pause there. Um, there's a ton of coins to go through, quite a lot of repeats, but we'll, we'll set these to the side for now. There's all these Genesex, that's epic, can't ever have too many Genesex. Um, but we do have a ton of bolt. Um, looks like they've been sent in in team bag, that's epic. We kind of have a little side project with bulk. So yeah, so eventually uh, I plan on getting into the selling a bulk or not necessarily bulk but I want to start selling maybe on TCG player um, doing something along those lines so I'm trying to accumulate as much bulk as possible currently for that hopefully we'll get eventually onto that like I said this one was given to me by a buddy um, I have some more bulk that was given to me I think I already processed that bulk uh, yeah I did process all of that bulk um, but it was sent over by Alex um, from last video, from last week video, um, he hooked it up with a little bit of bulk. It was fine, kind of, it was super awesome. There was a cool, bunch of cool finds. Um, I actually added a bunch to my um, actual personal binder that I um, it was a lot of green stars. 
But let's start going through some of this bulk. I'll set you up on my tripod and we'll go through a time lapse of me going through this. Normally sorting through bulk is a little bit different. It looks like a lot of this is actually already sleeved and separated. So looks like a lot of work has been cut out there. Some of it's not sleeved as you can tell. But normally the first thing that I do when I go through bulk is I separate all the hollows, reverse hollows, um, anything better pretty much than a hollow reverse hollow as well. Um, anything that's foiled pretty much. And then we separate out. Um, I don't really worry about like if that symbol's quite right off the bat. Um, if it's not hollow or reverse hollow or better. Because um, you do get, you know, the, uh, what is it, the ultra rare, um, regular rares, whatever they're called. Um, looks like that comes promos right there, promos as well. Normally I'll separate out, stuff like that. So let me get y'all set up and we'll go through this bulk. Um, it's probably going to be a two-parter because it's super late right now. So I'll just start it out and we'll finish it out tomorrow. Um, and then we'll come back and recap on what we have. All right, guys, uh, so I've made it to a quick stopping point. Um, I've done got a Type 5 Pikachu over here. Um, unfortunately, we we broke old guy. Um, took out my elbow. Um, knocked some stuff down as we were backing up. Stuff's all over the place. But let me flip the camera around. So here's what we got so far. I think I counted 30. Reverse hollows, unsleeved. I haven't counted these yet. These are all reverse hollows, reverse um, hollows, promo. And then these are all celebrations. As you can tell, energies. This one was just a evolution. Um, evolutions are very popular, so I normally separate those out as well. Um, three reverse hollow trainers, some more trainers. Um, I guess that was actually the trainers or an item card, whatever you want to call it. The rest of this is um, non hollow. This is all non hollow as well, um, but it was steeped up. It's a mixture of, um, of rarities from common and common um, to rare. Um, so is this going to be the same? Um, I still have quite a bit to go through. Like I said, this one wasn't too bad just because a lot of it actually is separated out. Um, so that was really nice on the previous owner's part. So I'm going to call it here and then I will come back to y'all tomorrow. Afternoon. All right, guys, welcome back to it. It is day two. Um, I had stopped yesterday. It was getting a little too late. And then these are all just... Um, a mixture of regular un or uncommon, uncommon um, rares that are sleeved. Um, I'm not sure exactly why, but they are. I mean, these are nice, I guess. Um, let's see, There's nothing, nothing too crazy. So I'm not too sure, but they are sleeved. So eventually, we'll go to unsleeve them and reuse those sleeves on a different one, more than likely. We are just about halfway, if not a little bit more. I'm not too positive. I didn't actually count how many breaks we had. Um, but we'll go through this next one right here real quick.
few actually in here. Three, it looks like there's one more in the back maybe. Some more hollows. It looks like these are all hollows. This one has a scratch in there. Yep, that was all hollows and then there is one more in there that's ethnic. Yeah, there's those. Starting to add a little bit more energies back over here. Um, move them off to the side. What is this? Oh, that was part of our other one here, another trainer. Forgot about this, set it off to the side. And that's it for that one as well. Quite a lot of tiny baits in there. This one's a little bit lighter. Let's see what's in here. Looks like this is all. Uh, what's the word? Um, shining stars. Brilliant stars. I keep wanting to say shining stars. working on this set currently, so I'll double check these to make sure that I'm not missing any of the verses. I think I have most of the commons and non-commons, so that's the point I'm just working on the verses. And pretty much the arts, regular arts, all that good stuff. It's an upside down one, nothing too crazy. There's that. All the time and then I'm going back for the second round sorting everything into sets there's another another uh, crocheted one you know I'm gonna start a collection we're starting a binder it's official we're starting a po crocheted Pokemon binder you heard it here first Torchic Torchic Not really sure what's going on with this one. It doesn't look like it's a uh, factory. It's, no. You can feel some rays. I don't. It looks like just ink. We'll set it off to the side and we'll we'll ask on the forms. On Facebook, everybody knows on Facebook, you know. So we'll see what.
And that's it for that part of it. There we go. And like I said, that was just to go through sorting out, or not even sorting out, just taking out stuff that catches my eye, getting the hollows out. That way they don't get scratched up, going through it. Um, but normally what I would do at this point is start sleeving stuff up. I don't have enough sleeves. I could just have a bunch of little spare ones. Um, definitely not enough for that though. I might have to run out to the store and grab a few. So yeah, let me do that real quick and then I'll be back. Four stores later and we have found sleeves. That was wild, but yeah. Did find some sleeves at GameStop of all places. I actually stopped there for something else and just happened to see them there. And I was like, well, that's all I got right now. I need them right now. So, yeah, they're like really thick too. Pretty odd. In the 102, weird number. But yeah, let me get started on sleeving and then I'll get back to y'all. Okay guys, so that was a lot. That was a lot of uh, sleeves for sure, but everything that is hollow has been sleeved at this point, outside of this metal corner, just in the corner. Or crochet metal corner. Like that. But yeah, so I did get a count as well a while ago of how much we have here in total worth of cards or just card count. So our total card count was actually 1,753 cards overall. Now reverse hollows, we had 395. So that's, this right here is all 395 worth of cards or of cards. Hollows, we had 59 hollows. Um, we had, 23 celebrations, 19 promos, which I package promos normally I'll keep stored for quite a while. And then one McDonald's card and for our bulk, bulk total was well, not full total, so this is a mixture. I still have, like I said, I still have to go back to it. There's a lot of stuff that's playable, like Smanty. Um, but just non hollow, I guess. We had 1,222 cards, and then for trainers, we had 34. So that's pretty much all of it. This is all non hollow as well, as part of that. But yeah, guys, I'm going to sort this out. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to include that in the video at this point. I don't think so. It's probably running kind of late. If you want to see more of this kind of stuff, let me know for sure. I have more bulk coming in. I have two more purchases coming in and those I actually paid for or am going to pay for. I have to do the counts and then um, let the person know how much it was sold and pay them out for it. 
but overall, that's pretty much all I have, I guess, at this point. Um, let me know if you're enjoying this, and I will see you on the next one. Like, comment, subscribe.